everybody and welcome back to another video and today I'll be showing you guys my setup. So some of these products that I have, been, I have used, I did a review on them and if you guys want any of these products that I use, I'll leave a link in the description below. So first we have tripods that I use. So this is a handheld tripod and you also can put it on like a table and it does have a balance bubble. And this is good for camcorder and cameras. So this is the tripod. You can make it stand like this. I also have another professional tripod here. It has a lot of features to it. You can make it tilt. You can tilt your camera. You can rotate it. And you can put it at a perfect, perfect angle you would like. It also has a balance bubble here. It looks green, so you would just, the bubble would be in the middle, that means it's balanced. So it does, this one does go really, it's really longer than this one. So I use this for just standing on the table, I use this to stand on the floor to record my videos. So this is how you open it, you just unlock it. So as you can see it's really long, like this long. So I'll put a link to this tripod and this small tripod in the description below. Okay, so it's really heavy and it's pretty um, good. It does have some other features where you can tighten your camera here. Okay, so next product that I use is my iPad for mobile gameplay. So I use an iPad here. It's an iPad 6th generation. It has 32 gigabytes and it is like this big and I'll show you what my iPad looks like. So it looks like this. Just like a regular iPad. It is pretty fast. I really like it. It's fast and not laggy for Fortnite. So this is a good iPad for me. So I do use this for my Fortnite mobile gameplays. So if you guys want a link, I'll put it in the description below. I do also have a SteelSeries Nimbus controller. And this is used for mobile and it's wireless, it's Bluetooth. You just have to hook it up in the settings and connect it to your iPad. You do use this for many games. I uh, sometimes use this for mobile, Fortnite, and it is pretty good. If you guys want one of these, I'll put a link in the description below. It's like a PS4 layout. Does not have clickable analog sticks though. And I also have another controller for PC and PS3. It's the Easy S. MX controller. It is like Xbox controller. So if you guys like an Xbox layout, so this will be a perfect controller for you for PC. So it does have clickable analog sticks and it's exactly like an Xbox controller. Also use a webcam for computer gameplays. So this is a Logitech C930E webcam and it, this is what it looks like. Okay, so this is what the Logitech camera looks like. It is like this where you can just hook it up. Put it on your computer and it does have this thing here. So you can put this on the tripod too. So it looks it does have a privacy shade, so it looks like this. 
it is pretty clear it's 1080p it's HD it is a good camera that I use for my computer gameplays I also have a gaming mouse it is a pretty good gaming mouse it lights up the lights uh, matches with whatever sensitivity it has so it does have lights you can put it up but the more up it goes the higher your sensitivity is so it is a wired mouse so I really like it it has two buttons on the side too so this is what it looks like yeah the lights right here so this is a pretty awesome gaming mouse and if you want a link to that mouse I'll leave a link to the in the description below okay so this is the computer that I use sometimes and it is a Dell used computer so this is a computer at start I'm gonna try to get a good better gaming con computer in the future but this is what I use for some of my gameplays and it is kind of laggy but that's why I got an iPad and I started using playing I mobile mo now because it's not even laggy and I like mobile better than computer because computer is pretty laggy and I'll be showing you guys what how do you put this on the camera on so you just have to put this of course USB in your computer I do use this recording with Bandicam so if you guys want a link in the I'll put a link in the description below unfortunately I don't have a link to this computer and this is just how you put it on so I would just use this on with the recording software Bandicam so I do use the computer and the webcam sometimes and it's pretty nice and also I have a cooling pad for my laptop so this cools down your laptop and I bought this so the laptop doesn't overheat and doesn't like lag too much because heating will make you, you lag in your games and this is quiet also quiet so I'll leave a link in the description below if you guys want a cooling pad for your laptop and it does have some lights you just have to hook it up to your computer there's a USB and it is pretty quiet and it's cool for your computer and also I have a Canon PowerShot SX 280HS it's a full HD camera so it is pretty clear I am currently using it right now I use it for some of my face cams and it's pretty clear and easy to use it's pretty light and is it? I'll put a link to this camera in the description below so if you guys want one I'll put a link below this camera is pretty old but there is more models that are better than this camera but I use this camera for my face cams okay so this is the camera that I use for some of my face cams so this is the camera Canon it's PowerShot it's full HD PowerShot SX 280HS camera so it does have some features to it on the front I'm currently right now recording with my iPad. It's the iPad 6th generation. So what do you guys think of the quality? And what do you guys think of all the products that I have been using? And I'll put a link to this camera in the description below. And I also use these Hus phone for my gameplays. So this is a Koshin Each G2000 headphones. It has LED LED lights and this is what it looks like it has some earmuffs so this is what 
it looks like. So it has some earmuffs, so it's pretty comfortable. And this is uh, the microphone, so you can talk. And also, you could put this microphone on and off, turn up the volume, or put the volume down. So this is what it looks like when it lights up. I actually have a other USB for the lights, so that's weird. Well, let's test it out. Oh yeah. This is what the mouse looks like when it lights up. So this they have different colors. This one green, it's more faster and then up, it's more faster. So this is the highest and it's super fast. But I stick to the lowest or blue. And this is what it looks. So the headphones, this is what it, the lights look like looks the same as this, this mouse. So let me turn off the lights. This is what it looks like. It looks cool and it's pretty comfortable and it is a clear microphone. I use this microphone on Bandicam too and I use this microphone to record my gameplays. So This is a good microphone. So also if you guys want a link to this headphone, I'll leave a link in the description below. So these products are pretty awesome and cheap and pretty affordable. Okay, so this is a cheap setup and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will be trying to get a better computer as my channel grows and thank you guys for the support lately i really appreciate it and i hope you guys enjoy this video be sure to subscribe share and leave a comment below and thumbs up and i'll put all of these links down below in the description but accept the computer and i hope you guys enjoy this video and i'll see you guys next time bye